Hi, nice people. I picked up this knife uh, from uh, Nav Ship Free, Bug River. Uh, this is uh, Fox River Rico. Uh, this is regular Fox River. Both uh, came with uh, Bushcraft B shield. Uh, this uh, formerly had a shaving problem inside the sheath but now uh, it is almost uh, disappear no problem but uh, now this uh, sheath and knife has a very severe shaving problem very tight however i expect this will uh, disappear soon okay no problem And uh, great knife, as always. Uh, desert ironwood. Uh, wavy pattern, black and brown. Uh, very beautiful. And this handle is different from regular uh, Fox River. Well contoured, groove uh, and uh, swell and groove. And thinner than regular one, so it doesn't fill my hand. Uh, instead, uh, free, uh, various holding it allows me. I love this type of hand very much. And uh, this regular one, thicker and uh, straight. You can see the difference between the two. In this dimension, you cannot notice the difference. Uh, this has a lanyard ring, this doesn't. As I said, uh, advantage in various holding, advantage in stability in regular holding. Uh, it is designed for extended holding, three finger holding, I believe. So, no lanyard ring here. This holding very comfortable. This extended holding not comfortable. Uh, this is for deep slicing, I believe. This handle, this recurve. Uh, when skinning, uh, until the vertical angle, mm, no problem with this knife. However, uh, over the vertical angle, uh, this rig curve uh, has advantage, I believe, uh, something like uh, pulling. Okay, so uh, in conclusion, handle uh, extension is good and uh, weak cut and deep cutting is good and edge geometry is different. This has flat portion from the spine to here and uh, convexing uh, steep like bravo. So this edge must be tougher than regular. Uh, in uh, this reason, uh, this is, this must be uh, more uh, big game hunting knife than regular uh, Fox River. Uh, this handle uh, thinner, however, uh, very comfortable. I love this handle very much.
No problem. Mm, very good handle and very good blade. As always, it is extremely sharp. I can't believe it. This is Buck Weaver's uh, convex. Okay, and uh, I was a bit anxious about sharpening um, or stropping. And this regular one is easy to strop, of course. Stropping should be uh, vertical to the edge. This is beginning and this is finishing. Easy. This recurve a bit high angle. Mm, no problem. And this is good movement. And I use a uh, cross side to me. I don't think uh, you must, uh, uh, you know, be anxious about this dropping. Easy way, no problem. That's it. So. Uh, this is absolutely big game designed in the same size for extended holding, strong edge geometry, and recurve. Well thought knife. Amazing. Even this knife, amazing. This is extraordinary amazing. I purchased a new camera. This is extraordinary amazing. I'm now making a video uh, on my computer and uh, I have a new video camera here. This is uh, Sony Handycam uh, model uh, 370. Uh, very small stuff. And uh, this unique point is uh, this has a wide lens. And formerly, uh, video camera has uh, no wide lens, so uh, we must uh, put a bulky a wide conversion lens in front of the camera. However, uh, this one has uh, inside wide lens, uh, 29 millimeter uh, in conversion to uh, regular camera lens. Uh, 29 is wide enough in order to make a video inside house like uh, a knife review or cross range uh, small room in car or somewhere like that uh, very useful uh, brand new one uh, anyhow very small very handy incredible uh, Compared to the uh, handgun, this is uh, Glock. You compare the difference between the two. Very small. I don't think this is a real gun. Uh, 
Airsoft gun. Okay. Thank you very much for watching. See you. Bye-bye.